Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into one of the most exciting announcements in the world of drones for 2025. DJI has officially confirmed the release of the DJI Neo 2, a compact but far more powerful upgrade that is already generating a lot of buzz in the tech community. Unlike the small step-by-step -step upgrades that many drone makers release year after year, this time DJI seems to have taken a bold leap. The Neo 2 is being positioned not just as a travel-friendly drone, but as a professional imaging tool, something that blends portability with high-end features in a way that could appeal to both hobbyists and professionals. When it comes to drones, we often see products that lean in one of two directions. Some are made for beginners, lightweight, affordable, and easy to fly, but lacking in serious performance. Others are large and powerful, designed for professionals who don't mind carrying a bulkier setup and paying premium prices. But the DJI Neo 2 looks like it's aiming to sit in the sweet spot right in the middle. It's compact enough to take anywhere, yet powerful enough to be used for serious creative work. And that's exactly why so many people are calling it one of the most important drone releases of 225. So in this breakdown, we're going to look closely at everything that makes the DJI Neo 2 special. We'll talk about its rumored flight, performance, its endurance in the air, the upgraded transmission technology, and how it compares to other drones in its class. We'll then move into pricing and DJI's strategy for this release, followed by a detailed look at its portability and design, its professional-grade camera system, and the intelligent features that are becoming essential for drone pilots. Finally, we'll explore connectivity options, smart integration, and who exactly DJI is targeting with this drone. By the end of this section, you'll have a complete understanding of why the Neo 2 could be one of the most significant releases. In years, the leap in flight power and endurance led S, start with flight performance because this is at the heart of every drone. DJI already has a strong reputation in this area. Over the past decade, they've refined their flight control systems to deliver smooth, reliable, and stable experiences, even for beginners. But the Neo 2 is expected to raise the bar even higher. Reports suggest that DJI has equipped this drone with a completely redesigned propulsion system, allowing it to reach top speeds of around 60 miles per hour for a foldable, compact drone. That's an incredible achievement. Speed, of course, isn't the only thing that matters. What's even more impressive is the expected flight time of up to 40 minutes. For context, many mid-range drones today struggle to get past 30 minutes in real-world conditions. Adding an extra 10 minutes might not sound dramatic at first, but, in practice, it can make the difference between capturing that perfect cinematic sequence and missing the shot, because your battery ran out. Imagine trying to film a sunset that only lasts a few minutes. With older drones, you might have to land, change batteries, and reposition, losing the moment in the process. With the Neo 2, you'll likely have enough time to capture it all in a single take. This kind of endurance is a game changer for creators. Whether you're a travel vlogger, filming in remote areas, or a real estate professional capturing sweeping aerial shots of a property, longer airtime means fewer interruptions and smoother work. And when paired with the Okuzink 4.0 transmission system, which reportedly allows for a range of up to 15 kilometers with near zero latency, the Neo 2 looks like one of the most reliable drones in its class. Transmission is often overlooked by beginners, but for professionals, it's a critical feature. Imagine flying over a large landscape, streaming your footage in real time to your controller or smartphone. If the signal cuts out or becomes unreliable, you lose not only control but also confidence in your equipment. Okuzink 4.0 ensures stable, high-quality video transmission, even in challenging environments where interference could be an issue. For those who want to push their creativity further, this stability is essential. Pricing and market strategy now. Let's talk about something that often decides whether a drone becomes widely adopted or not. Pricing DJI has been very smart about how they position their products. On one end, they have entry-level drones like the Mini Series, which are designed for beginners and casual flyers. On the other, they have flagship drones like the Mavic 3 Pro, which come with premium price tags and are aimed at professionals. The DJI Neo 2, according to analysts, will fall somewhere in between, with a price expected between $1,200 and $1,500. This place is at above the entry-level range, but still well below the flagship category. And this is a clever strategy. It means DJI can target a wide group of buyers who want more than what the entry-level drones can deliver, but who aren't ready or don't need to spend thousands of dollars on a flagship model. Think about content creators who are serious about their craft but don't have massive production budgets, or vloggers who want professional-looking footage without carrying heavy equipment. Even small businesses like real estate agents or event organizers could see the Neo 2 as the perfect tool. It's powerful enough to deliver results, 
but the investment is still manageable compared to higher-end drones. This mid-tier approach also helps DJI fend off competition. Other brands might try to compete at the budget level or the flagship level, but very few manage to deliver this kind of balance in the middle. By offering the Neo 2 at this price point, DJI is not just selling a drone. They're building a product that could dominate its segment of the market. Compact. Design built for mobility portability is another key factor in drone design today. It's no longer just about what a drone can do in the air, it's about how easy it is to take it with you. The Neo 2 reportedly features a foldable design, allowing it to shrink down to a size small enough to fit into a backpack. This makes it a perfect travel companion, especially for creators who are constantly on the move. But portability doesn't mean fragility. DJI has built the Neo 2 using lightweight yet durable materials, ensuring that it can withstand the demands of outdoor shooting. Whether you're hiking up a mountain, exploring a remote beach, or filming in a crowded city, you want a drone that's tough enough to handle different environments without weighing you down. The Neo 2 seems designed with exactly this in mind. For travelers, this is huge. One of the biggest barriers to using drones on the go has always been their size and bulk. Carrying a larger drone often requires its own dedicated case, which isn't practical when you're traveling light. The Neo 2 eliminates that problem. You can simply slide it into your bag alongside your camera gear, ready to fly whenever inspiration strikes. Professional imaging in a compact body, of course. The real centerpiece of the Neo 2 is its camera system. After all, for most buyers, the ability to capture stunning visuals is the number one reason to invest in a drone. Rumors suggest that the Neo 2 will feature a 1-inch CMOS, Sensor capable of capturing 20 megapixel stills and recording 5.4K video at 60 frames per second. That level of performance immediately places it in a league above many compact drones. A 1-inch sensor allows for far better image quality, especially in low light, compared to smaller sensors found in entry-level models. For filmmakers and photographers, this means sharper details, richer colors, and more flexibility in post-production. DJI is also expected to include features like 10-bit D-Log color support, which provides a wider dynamic range and greater control over color grading. This is the kind of feature professionals demand, as it makes footage far more adaptable during editing. Add to that an adjustable aperture, which allows for creative control over exposure and depth of field, and you have a camera system that rivals some of DJI's larger drones. Dot the result is a compact drone that doesn't compromise on image quality. Whether you're shooting vast landscapes, capturing time lapses in urban environments, or filming fast-paced action, the Neo 2 promises to deliver results that are ready for professional use intelligent features and safety enhancements, but what really makes modern drones exciting isn't just their raw power rights, their intelligence. DJI has been a leader in this area for years, introducing features that make drones easier and safer to fly, even for beginners. The Neo 2 looks set to continue this trend with a host of intelligent features. First, it is expected to include Omni Obstacle Avoidance, powered by advanced algorithms. This means the drone will be able to detect and avoid obstacles in every direction, making flights safer and more confident. For new pilots, this is a lifesaver. It reduces the risk of crashes and accidents, which can be both costly and discouraging. For experienced pilots, it adds an extra layer of security when flying in complex environments. In addition, DJI is expected to bring its advanced flight modes to the Neo 2, including Active Track 5.0, Point of Interest 4.0, and Mac. These modes make it easier to create cinematic shots without needing advanced piloting skills. For example, Active Track allows the drone to automatically follow a subject while avoiding obstacles. Perfect for sports, travel vlogs, or dynamic filmmaking. Another key feature is the improved return to home system. Unlike basic versions that simply fly back in a straight line, the Neo 2's system can dynamically recalculate safe paths, avoiding obstacles on the way back. 